Okay guys, so we're going to make a tuna crunch. A bit like what Greg's does but with a bit more ingredients. So that were um, one tin of tuna chunks in spring water. That's just what I get. You can get them in oil, sunflower oil, get it in whatever you want, brine. Uh, cucumber, finely chopped. Celery, optional by the way. All of these are optional if you want, but celery, um, finely chopped, and uh, two spring onions, finely chopped. That were half a celery stick, I didn't do a full one. It'd be too strong for one tuna. Uh, so basically, just gonna add all these straight into there, into the tuna. So, cucumber in, celery in, spring onion in. I'm surprised how far this goes then. Give it a stir. Stir that in. Pepper. In. Probably half a teaspoon of pepper I've put in. But you put what you want in, just to taste. Salt, to taste. Mix that up. got some almonds real mayonnaise just bought them as the two quid it's good and you can use salad cream as well but I only use uh, mayonnaise because my partner don't like salad cream but I like it better actually with salad cream but yeah and that's it done ready to go on your sandwich now I'm going to put this on I made some homemade bread earlier uh, if you want to know how to do that just check out my previous vlogs um, and you'll see how I've, how I've made uh, my own homemade bread. So now I'm going to uh, butter some homemade bread, cut and butter it, put this on it, garnish it with a bit of tomato, job done. So I'll just let me get to, get some bread out. Okay, yep, so I've cut and buttered some homemade bread, made this today. Lovely white homemade bread. Like I say, if you want to see how I've done that, I made my first one the other day. I've, uh, did a couple of test runs and uh, yeah, I'm getting good at it now. Really nice, soft, fresh, perfect. Tuna crunch on. Look at that. Lovely, creamy, plenty of ingredients in it. See how far you make one tin of tuna go. Perfect. Plenty on. So we've got celery, cucumber, spring onion. You can use normal onions if you want white onions or brown onions, uh, red onion, spring onion, not pickled onion. Uh, yeah, so that one's a bit sparse. Yeah, so I'm trying to make a few uh, short videos because. Uh, I've been I've done a couple of them, they're like 26 and 30 odd minutes long uh, and I don't want to bore everybody to death so I started making a few smaller ones. A bit of tomato. Just to finish it off. Perfect, look at that, beautiful. Simple, 10 minutes. We've got a proper meal. Fit for kings. Look at that. Beautiful. Right, let's have a taste of this bad boy. There we go. Mm. Absolutely perfect. Beautiful. You could probably put garlic in that. If you want to drop a bit, uh, a couple of cloves of garlic, mix it in with it. You can probably put chilies in with it. You can put what you want in it, peppers, anything. No limit. It's got a nice crunch to it. Taste the onion coming through. Salt and pepper, a bit of mayo, tuna, fantastic. Okay, guys. Yeah, uh, hope you've enjoyed this quick little vlog. Uh, if you give us a thumbs up and a like be much appreciated, uh, subscribe, it costs nothing to subscribe, 
uh, see if we can build the channel a little bit more and I'll uh, be making all sorts in future, I'll make some curries and kebabs and onion barges, we'll do all sorts of pies, anything you can think of we'll have a go at, uh, we'll learn it together. Alright guys, thanks for watching, see you on the next one.